in this module we shall prove that the commutator subgroup of g which is denoted by c is the normal subgroup of g let's state the theorem let g be a group then the commutator subgroup c of g is a normal subgroup of g now we establish the theorem we must show that c is normal in g and the uh, theorem on uh, previous module we have shown that c consists of precisely of all finite products of commutators for x belonging to c we must show that g inverse x g belongs to c for all g belonging to g to is case ke andar agar hum ye establish kar dein ke for all g belonging to g x belongs to c g inverse x g बी सी को बिलोंग कर रहा है कम्पोटेटर को बिलोंग कर रहा है देन वी आर डन और डेट इफ एक्स इज अ प्रोडक्ट ऑफ कम्पोटेटर सो इज जी इनवर्स एक्स जी फॉर ऑल जी बिलोंगिंग टू जी या हम ये शो कर दें कि अगर एक्स हमारे पास कम्पोटेटर प्रोडक्ट है तो जी इनवर्स एक्स जी बी प्रोडक्ट ऑफ कम्पोटेटर्स हम अगर एस्टेब्लिश कर दें तो देन इन डेट केस वी आर डन बाय इंसर्टिंग ई इक्वल टू जी जी इनवर्स बिटवीन ईच प्रोडक्ट ऑफ कम्यूटेटर्स अकर्डिंग इन एक्स वी सी डेट इट इज सफिशेंट टू शो फॉर ईच कम्यूटेटर सी डी सी इनवर्स डी इनवर्स that g inverse c d c inverse d inverse g is in c if we establish this then we say that uh, uh, c is the normal subgroup of g but g inverse c d c inverse d inverse g equal to g inverse c d c inverse e d inverse g to yahan pe aap dekh sakte hain humne g inverse c d c inverse ko separate kar liya d inverse g ko separate kar liya aur beech mein ek identity element se multiply kar diya to jo equality hai wo hold karegi kyunki by identity law g inverse c d c inverse as it is d inverse g as it is and we replaced e by g d inverse d g inverse you can see that uh, inverse d inverse into d is the identity element and uh, when we multiply g with the identity element we shall get g and g into g inverse is also an identity element uh, just uh, we have make this substitution to write g inverse c d g inverse c inverse and you can see that when we take the inverse of g inverse c we shall get c g inverse inverse that is c g uh, and uh, we shall get c g and uh, uh, we shall obtain g inverse c d and uh, inverse of uh, g inverse c and uh, which is equal to c inverse g and uh, uh, we uh, in this way Uh, actually we are forming a commutator uh, first element is g inverse c and the second element is d then we want to see the inverse of g inverse c and then we want to take 
inverse of d to make a commutator uh, so uh, you can see that c inverse g equal to g inverse c whole inverse and it is uh, into d inverse so we have completed in square bracket one commutator uh, we are uh, substituting e in such a manner so that we make the product of commutators and uh, uh, then we shall obtain uh, dg inverse and uh, uh, we have d inverse next and g inver inverse of g inverse is g and we have next g and this is another commutator which is in c so aap ab yahan pe badi easily dekh sakte hain ke g inverse c d c inverse d inverse g a belongs to c to kyunki ye do commutator ke product ki form mein aa chuka hai thus c is a normal subgroup of g